Okay, I've got the Farmer Tech MS380 uh, handle, and I'm going to be assembling the uh, the engine and the you know putting the top on and so forth. So I need to. Be sure when I put it on my handle that um, first off that it holds pressure uh, and second is that the tank vent releases pressure. So um, what we're going to do is I'll take my pressure and insert it into the fuel line like so take my pressure gun pull that out so that its pressure rises it oops I'm sorry that puts a vacuum on it which is fine See it slowly dropping. That's what we want to see. Okay, now push that the other way. Will it hold a pressure? And it is not holding pressure. Let's try that again. Well, my needle stopped from falling. So let's just go again. Uh, it's holding. So the cap just wasn't tight enough. I can live with that. I'm going to do that vacuum again. Vacuum is steady. That's not good. Oh, it's leaking off some. 
I think the leak down should be quicker than that. Okay, I just took a, a sharpie and went down in between there. Okay. Do it again. See if the rubber was just stuck together. We want to see a leak down. Now that's leaking. That's all it took. It just needed a little bit of help. So what I learned was the um, the cap was good. The cap is sealing, the vent is venting, and the hose is, you know, complete. No, there's no tears or breaks in it or whatever. Of course, it's new, but you never can tell. Now, there's another pressure test that we need to do, and we'll do that as soon as I get the top on and get it on the handle. And then soon after we'll we'll fire up. 